Hey y'all, I'm a big fan of trying to find cooking techniques that let the ingredients shine through, but also allow me to try new flavors from different parts of the world. This dish does just that by adding a little ginger and soy sauce, or liquid aminos, to give it a bit of an Asian flavor. If you do use soy sauce, remember to look for gluten-free tamari, as regular soy sauce is actually derived from wheat and isn't even soy at all. And while I know that many people try to avoid soy at all costs, a little traditional soy sauce every now and then is not the same thing as consuming soy-derived ingredients in everything you eat. And of course, if you still want to avoid soy, I totally get it, and liquid aminos will work just fine. On that note, let's get cooking. First, boil a pot of water. Add the broccoli to the boiling water for two minutes. This blanches the veggies. Then drain and rinse with cold water. Set that aside. Heat a fair amount of oil in a large pan, or wok if you have one, over medium-high heat. Once the oil is hot, add the onion, garlic, and ginger and move everything around quickly to cook for about five minutes. Next, add the lamb and mix everything together. Let the lamb cook through for about 10 to 15 minutes. Then push lamb to one side and add the broccoli with some red pepper flakes, a dash or two of soy sauce, and let the broccoli cook for a few minutes. Scoop some lamb and broccoli in a bowl and let's eat. Thank you.